afternoon to my fellow classmates of 2020. Although this school year ended abruptly, our memories we share are forever. This school year was filled with exciting and stressful moments from pet rallies to homecoming, as well as late night studying and exams. The COVID-19 pandemic, also known as the Rona, has affected our class tremendously considering that we didn't get to enjoy what prior classes did. There were many things that we could be sad about, but with the help of our friends, family, and staff, we persevered. We still have so much to look forward to and our whole lives ahead of us. I made the best out of my senior year while I could, and I hope you did too. Thank you, class. I know you would do big things. Here's to the future, 2020 out. Please join me in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Members of the graduating class of 2020, your day has arrived. Today, you become graduates of Lakeland High School. With the work of high school now complete, you enter into a world of opportunity. Where some see hopeless problems and conflicts, you have the opportunity to find purpose and pragmatism. While others complain, you have the opportunity to bring about needed reform. While others shirk their responsibilities, your actions can respect the cost of freedom. You will have opportunities to bring love where there is hate, cures where there is disease, food to the hungry, hope to the forlorn, and action to injustice. In your work, you will have opportunity to bring your labor, knowledge, and creativity to meet the needs of your employer and the public they serve. For those of you joining the military, we salute you and appreciate that you are taking the opportunity to serve and protect us all. You each have special gifts that can be used to create a better world, a better nation, a better community, and a better home. As Cavaliers of the Class of 2020, you have grown together, won championships together, and supported each other in defeat. You have learned the value of sportsmanship and hopefully the value of learning for the rest of your lives. You now have the opportunity to lead and support those who follow. As alumni of Lakeland High School, you will forever be Cavaliers and a vital part of your school. You will be the example for many in your community. So share kindness in every opportunity and be trustworthy in all of your dealings. Obey the golden rule and joy will not be far away. Among you today are champions in athletics, award-winning artists, authors, musicians, and poets. Others, and some the same, have sequenced DNA, genetically modified bacteria, and conducted truly amazing scientific research as part of the third cohort of the biomedical program at Lakeland High School. And nine of you, the largest such group ever, graduate high school having already completed your associate's degree. You have all been a vital part of the Lake Show and have been hashtag LHS awesome in so many ways. I share your pride in this defining moment. Cavaliers, your futures have no limits. Your futures are as bright as you allow them to be. And Cavaliers, your futures begin right now. On behalf of the Suffolk School Board, I bring greetings and congratulations to our 2020 graduates. We as a board thank each of you for the part you have played in making Suffolk Public Schools a great success. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce our Suffolk School Board. Representing the Cypress Borough, Ms. Karen Jenkins. Representing the Sleepy Hole Borough, Mr. Dave Mitnick. Representing the Holy Neck Borough, Ms. Loretta Mayo. Representing the Suffolk Borough, Mr. Tyron Riddick. Representing the Chocotuck Borough, Ms. Sherry Story. And representing the Nansaman Borough, Dr. Judith Brooks Buck. 
It is also my honor today and pleasure to introduce our superintendent, Dr. John B. Gordon III. In October of 2019, following a nationwide search, the Suffolk School Board selected Dr. Gordon as superintendent of Suffolk Public Schools. Dr. Gordon came to Suffolk Public Schools with a wealth of experience in public education. During his 24 years in education, he had served as an elementary teacher, a high school teacher, a dean of students, an assistant principal, a winning high school basketball coach, a high school principal, director of administrative services in Fredericksburg City Schools, and chief of schools in Chesterfield County Public Schools. Dr. Gordon had also served as an adjunct professor at Eastern Mennonite University, University of Mary Washington, and University of Virginia. Dr. Gordon has been a presenter for the Virginia School Board Association and the Virginia Education Association, as well as being published in numerous educational journals and recently published his first book entitled The Teacher's Lounge. Dr. Gordon received his Bachelor of Arts degree from UVA, Master of Education from UVA, a post-master's certificate in educational leadership from VCU, and a doctorate in educational leadership and policy studies from Virginia Tech. Upon Dr. Gordon's arrival in Suffolk Public Schools, he initiated his entry plan with the theme of building the best Suffolk Public Schools. This plan including building relationships, building teamwork, building student achievement and success, building an efficient school system, and building community involvement and engagement. Dr. Gordon is married to his wife, Siobhan, and they have three children. It, again, it gives me great pleasure to introduce Dr. John B. Gordon III, Superintendent of Suffolk Public Schools. Good afternoon, Cavaliers. I am Dr. John B. Gordon III, Division Superintendent of Suffolk Public Schools. I want to be one of the first people to officially say congratulations to the Lakeland High School graduating class of 2020. All of you can smile and relax because you made it. For 13 years, you have worked hard to get to this very moment. All of the long hours of being in class, studying, doing homework was all worth it so you can say you graduated. For all of our viewers out there who may not really understand what it means to be a Lakeland High School Cavalier, I want to give you a little insight. Lakeland High School is a school of tradition. The graduating class of 2020 understands what it means to persevere, to have determination, and to be remembered as one of the greatest classes in Suffolk Public School history. From our nationally recognized Project Lead the Way biomedical program to our state champion men's basketball team, all of you are hashtag LHS awesome. I am so proud of all of you, but I must remind you that life does not stop here. Please go on to do great things. Represent your families, the city of Suffolk, Suffolk Public Schools, and Lakeland High School to the best of your ability. Become the great citizens that we all know you are, and we hope we have prepared you for life. I know that all of your teachers and administrators have done everything in their power to assist you along your educational journeys. I know your students thank you for being both caring and supportive as you push them to be the best that they can be. And to the class of 2020, you are the first examples of what a Suffolk Public Schools graduate will look like. Your ability to show resilience, be a student technology, and to be leaders is what it is all about. We are so happy and proud of all of you, and congratulations to the Lakeland High School graduating class of 2020. First and foremost, welcome and thank you. Welcome to all in attendance, and thank you to every single person that aided me in getting where I am, whether it was through encouragement, friendship, services, or love. The first verse of Lakeland's alma mater reads, we have come so far to get where we are. Some have gone, yet we still hold strong. With our heads to the sky, our faith will never die. Lakeland, we sang this song for you. Upon reading these lyrics, I discovered that they describe the class of 2020 perfectly. We have come far, further than previous classes ever imagined. While we all got the privilege of being naive freshmen, smart Alex sophomores, 
excitable juniors, and now proud seniors of Lakeland High School, we got one more privilege. We learned how to be victorious. Serena Williams once voiced, if winning is God's reward, then losing is how he teaches us. Throughout the years, we have been victorious in every grade, taking small and irrelevant hits for the sake of adolescence, living in, loving, and sometimes loathing the halls of Lakeland High School. However, in our final hours, we were met with a challenge that we could not ignore, that we had not come to expect. Years of growing and working diligently, all for one moment that seemed to have slipped through our fingers. We would no longer get the same experience as every other class. We get a better one. Because the class of 2020, as I have come to know them, are not ones for taking a seat when it becomes difficult. We might have come into this predicament unknowingly, and we might have been unprepared for it, but we overcame it, and that is something that no other class can bear witness to. We will not simply walk into the world with hopeful hearts. We will walk into the world with bravery because we as a collective have already been through world-shattering obstacles, and we know that they do not stand a chance. We lost certain qualities of our senior year only to be deemed victorious in the long run. I have gotten to know several members of the class of 2020, and I know what we are capable of. I am proud of what we are capable of. And I know that in the years to come, we will shine brighter than any other class before us because we have been hit, but we have not been knocked down. And so, as Lakeland alma mater goes, we have come so very far just to get where we are. Some have gone, but we are still holding strong. With our heads to the sky, our faith, our strength, and our courage will never die. The classes to follow will sing this song for us, the class of 2020. I am immensely proud of myself and every other member of the best class to come out of Lakeland High School. And I ask you to never think that you've lost anything, for it is only a lesson to prepare you for the many victories that you will surely have. And with that, class of 2020, I salute you. Thank you. Hello, everybody. I'd like to thank everyone for coming today. Family, friends, staff members of LHS, Principal Wagner, and the superintendent, Dr. Gordon. I'd also like to thank my mom and dad for supporting me throughout the years, and my older sister, Akia, for being my guide. Also, a special thank you to Mrs. McDonald, who has been teaching me since my freshman year. Before I start my speech, I would like to say that I procrastinate writing this speech because speech is not my forte. At Lakeland, I learned how to give great presentations, but now there's no PowerPoint to present. The class of 2020 is meant for greatness. We were born between 2001 and 2002 while the nation mourned 9-11, but our births had the effect of bringing hope and joy in the world, and here we are now in the midst of another tragedy, a pandemic. Yet, once again, we find a reason to smile and celebrate today, our graduation day. Maybe our generation is fated to have some of our biggest milestones occur during tragedies, from our births that brought us into this world to our high school graduation that is bringing us to the gateway to adulthood. But everything happens for a reason, and we are a light within the world that shows that things can and will get better. From my interactions with you these past four years, I can see that we are a group of resilient whippersnappers. Our graduation circumstances alone are a prime example of this. In a time where it is so easy to feel lonely, hurt, angry, or slighted, and you have every right to feel this way, you have instead gone above and beyond to find creative ways to keep our community together. From TikTok challenges to constant Zoom calls, we are a class that does not give up on each other. We often compare life to being a roller coaster with many ups and downs. At first glance, it may seem like our high school experience is more similar to a roller coaster than life in that it seems that to slope downward at the finish. Though we may forget the most important part, at the end of the roller coaster, we often exit with a smile and say we enjoyed the ride. As we leave our shared amusement park to celebrate our accomplishments, remember, even though we may not know every face of the class of 2020, I know that we are collectively rooting for each other because what we have gone through has created a bond between us that will be written in history books. Thank you.
I invite you in front of your video playing device to now rise. All candidates for graduation, prepare to turn your tassels. And now, Ms. Byram, school board members, Dr. Gordon, staff of Lakeland High School, parents and guests, by the power granted to me by the Commonwealth of Virginia and the Suffolk School Board, I declare that these candidates have met the requirements set forth and are now graduates of Lakeland High School. You may turn your task.